while you're in Zurich walking around, you're probably going to get hungry. Now, of course, there are many choices for eating in Zurich, from the casual street-side market, the coffee shop, the cafe, the snack bars, sandwich places, decent restaurants, high-quality restaurants, ultra-deluxe restaurants. They've got the full range. Crossing over Bahnhofstrasse, if you're starting to get hungry, there is one particular excellent restaurant that you might consider. This favorite restaurant choice near the Bahnhofstrasse is Europe's oldest vegetarian restaurant, Hiltlo. A little hard to pronounce it, but that's the name, Hiltlo. It's been in business at this location under the same name for over a hundred years, so they must be doing something right. Dig into their enormous buffet loaded with dozens of delicious, healthy choices. Then you weigh your plate at the cashier and sit where you like. Ground floor, upstairs, or at the sidewalk tables. Eat here first and you will surely come back another day or a night for more food from this great restaurant. It's really a popular hangout. They have a cocktail lounge on one side with all the young locals flocking here, enjoying their drinks and conversation and socializing. And then there's the main restaurant. And you'll notice that it's mostly locals in here. Zurich is not really a touristic city. It's more of a local place. They do business, they have their banks, their industries, their shops, their retail. And the economy is very stable, very well balanced. So there's not a lot of tourists here, and you don't see that many tourists in the restaurant either. It's locals, which is always a good sign. We had a chance to talk with one of the managers, and he described to us the procedure and a little bit of the history of Hiltlo. Well, Hilf is the oldest vegetarian restaurant in uh, Europe. It exists since 1898, and it's a very large operation now. We have a lot of people coming here. We're very famous for our Indian food, and it has always been vegetarian. The story is that Mr. Hiltl, uh Rolf Hilf is the present owner of this place, and um, he's, his great-grandfather had arthritis, and he stopped eating meat and he got cured. So there, started the whole Hilfel story 111 years ago, which was celebrated an, an anniversary. And, uh, well, have a look around. It's great food. Uh, it's very colorful, very fresh, and uh, we're very happy to have you here. Over here, you see the scale. We have a large buffet, and everything is just uh, weighed here. You get a ticket, which pops out right here, and that shows you the price, and you pay at your table. Okay, great. So you get what you want? Yeah. As little or as much as you want? Exactly. You pay for only for that, for the food you eat, and you, if you don't fill your plate too high, then uh, it's a reasonable price, but you yeah, can also have a... I noticed. So a, 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 re, a modest meal is about 20 US dollars, 25 yeah. US dollars. Yeah. You can also learn how to cook at Hiltlo. They have got a very elaborate, very refined, advanced vegetarian cooking school. And we had a chance to talk with one of the instructors. My name is Barbara Elmer. These are um, official cooking classes. Um, all these person, they don't know each other. And it's the first time they are cooking together. And actually, we had an Asian menu. And so after they cook it, they sit down and they eat yeah, the meal? Yeah, they sit down and eat uh, like the normal Hiltl guests. Very nice, right yeah, over the here, staff maybe? there, yeah. Oh. Also, das sind jetzt alles einzelne, freiwillige Leute, spontan zusammengewürfelte Gesellschaft. 